Hi, this is Josh, pharmacist with PharmacistTips.com, here with a brief overview of the medication Ondansetron. Ondansetron, in the U.S., sold under the brand name Zofran. It's an anti-emetic, uh, meaning it's used to treat nausea and vomiting. Initially, uh, Zofran was studied and approved for the treatment of nausea and vomiting due to chemotherapy uh, after uh, surgery or post-operative nausea and vomiting and nausea and vomiting due to radiation therapy. It is widely used off-label uh, for conditions such as nausea due to vertigo, pregnancy-associated nausea and vomiting, as well as others. Uh, we see it commonly used uh, 30 minutes before drinking uh, the prep for colonoscopy because it's a large volume of liquid been found to reduce the nausea from drinking that much liquid. On Dancitron dosage, it is available in tablets and oral dispersible tablets, or sometimes just called ODT tablets. Um, those are four and eight milligram tablets. Oral solution available in four milligram per five ml. And the, there is an injectable form available as well. Um, usually it's dosed 30 minutes prior to chemo, um, one to two hours prior to radiation, or about a half an hour, hour before surgery with anesthesia. Commonly in the retail pharmacy, we see one or two tablets every six to eight hours as needed for nausea and vomiting. Just your um, not re regular nausea and vomiting use generally three to four times a day is how we see that dosed. Side effects, uh, generally mild. It tends to be tolerated really well. Constipation, dry mouth can occur, diarrhea, headache, dizziness, drowsiness fever, rash, and itchiness, those all can occur, but by far most people feel a lot better because um, there's it's pretty miserable when you have nausea and vomiting, and this uh, tends to help a lot of people. Rarely we can see some heart problems, uh, severe allergic reaction, and serotonin syndrome, extremely rare. Um, couple of things to keep in mind when taking on Dancitron. Want to be certain our hands are dry when we're handling the ODT tablet because it begins to dissolve right as you put it in the mouth. So we don't want moisture on our fingers so the tablet starts to dissolve prior to putting it in the mouth. We want to peel off the foil on the ODT packaging. If you try and push it through that foil packaging, that tablet will just crumble. And the tablets do contain the artificial sweetener phenylalanine. So something to keep in mind, some folks are allergic to that. I appreciate you watching. Please like and subscribe.